yeah i hope uh, i can i you can see me and uh, so let's start about it i am sharing my screen so you can see here that uh, you can, uh, i hope you can see my screen so in the last class i told you what is google cloud computing and i have explained you so let's continue from that uh, google cloud platform is uh, google cloud and uh, you can access all the services from there the different services you can see it like uh, what are the services you can see it there like google app engine compute engine big data lab and different kind of services are there in the gcp that you can use use it so first of all the thing is that why do we require uh, like a uh, google cloud why do we need this google cloud what's the requirement of that why we use it right so i have already explained you in the uh, yesterday session that uh, we need this google cloud to save to storage to access the storage to process the data to run the our code and to deploy application for this we use a google cloud you can deploy your application there you can deploy website there a uh, website that is hosted on the server when we type on a url like this when we usually type it we can see it right so that's the thing that uh, whenever you type anything as amazon and all you can see the content on your screen so this this is the way of uh, like uh, that amazon and or various websites you can deploy on some server so this google cloud also one cloud computing service where you deploy various websites and all so google cloud computing let's uh, discuss more on that and it's a network a private network public network and all so google cloud is a virtual platform that i already explain you in my previous session that google cloud is a platform where uh, we are using it uh, 